What does the Bible teach about the importance of humility? Humility is a virtue highly esteemed in the Bible, reflecting an attitude of dependence on God, openness to His will, and consideration of others above oneself. Scripture repeatedly emphasizes the importance of humility in various contexts, contrasting it with pride and arrogance, which lead to destruction and judgment. Humility involves recognizing our own limitations, weaknesses, and need for God's grace, as well as valuing others' perspectives, feelings, and contributions. Jesus exemplified humility in his earthly life, willingly submitting to the Father's will, serving others selflessly, and humbling himself even to the point of death on the cross. The Bible promises that God exalts the humble but opposes the proud, urging believers to clothe themselves with humility and to treat others with gentleness, kindness, and compassion, following the example of Christ. How does the Bible instruct us to handle wealth and prosperity? The Bible offers principles for handling wealth and prosperity in a manner that honors God and promotes stewardship, generosity, and contentment. While wealth itself is not inherently sinful, Scripture warns against the dangers of greed, materialism, and the love of money, which can lead to spiritual bondage and moral corruption. Believers are encouraged to view their possessions as gifts from God entrusted to their care, recognizing their role as stewards and not owners of their resources. This involves practicing wise financial management, living within one's means, and prioritizing eternal investments over temporary riches. Additionally, Scripture calls for generosity towards those in need, sharing our resources with the poor, supporting the work of ministry, and advancing God's kingdom on earth. By cultivating a spirit of gratitude, generosity, and contentment, believers can experience true wealth and fulfillment that transcends material possessions and aligns with God's purposes for their lives. What does the Bible say about the power of words? The Bible attests to the profound influence of words, emphasizing their ability to build up or tear down, to bless or curse, and to impart life or death. Scripture cautions against the misuse of the tongue, warning of its destructive potential when employed for gossip, slander, or deceit. Instead, believers are exhorted to use their words wisely, speaking truth in love, edifying and encouraging others, and promoting unity and reconciliation. Jesus taught that, out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks, highlighting the intimate connection between words and the condition of one's heart. The book of Proverbs contains numerous teachings on the power of speech, advocating for honesty, kindness, and discretion in our communication, and reminding us that, reckless words pierce like a sword, but the tongue of the wise brings healing. By aligning our words with the truth of God's word and allowing the Holy Spirit to govern our speech, believers can bring glory to God and build up the body of Christ through their words. How can we discern God's guidance in our lives? Discerning God's guidance involves cultivating a sensitive spirit, attuned to the promptings of the Holy Spirit, and grounded in the truth of Scripture. It requires an intimate relationship with God through prayer, worship, and fellowship, as well as a willingness to listen attentively to His voice and obey His commands. The Bible serves as a primary source of divine revelation, providing wisdom, direction, and principles for discerning God's will in various life circumstances. Additionally, seeking counsel from mature believers, spiritual mentors, and trusted leaders can offer valuable insights and confirmation of God's guidance. Discernment is a lifelong journey that requires humility, patience, and a surrendered heart, trusting that God's plans are always for our good and His glory. By seeking God earnestly and submitting to His leading, believers can experience the peace and confidence that come from aligning their lives with His purposes. What does the Bible teach about the role of government? The Bible teaches that government is ordained by God to establish order, promote justice, and maintain societal stability. Scripture affirms the legitimacy of civil authorities and calls believers to respect and submit to their governing authorities as a matter of conscience and obedience to God. Rulers are tasked with upholding righteousness, protecting the welfare of their citizens, and administering justice impartially, while citizens are called to honor and pray for their leaders, pay taxes, and obey the laws of the land. However, the authority of earthly governments is not absolute and must be subject to God's higher moral law and principles of justice. The Bible also recognizes the responsibility of believers to advocate for righteousness, speak out against injustice, and engage in civic participation as agents of positive change in society. Ultimately, government is accountable to God, who reigns as the supreme ruler over all nations and kingdoms, and believers are called to seek His kingdom first and foremost in their allegiance and obedience.